Well, it's Sunday, week 11, and it's about 12.30, getting ready for this football Sunday. I am 6-4, and four. had a great, great week 10. I won by like 50 points. It was like 150 to 112, so literally like 40-something points. Anyway, um, yeah, my team did pretty good, even though Cooper Cup had zero points. So I'm really kind of concerned about him and what's going on with that Rams offense. But um, I I think he should be able to bounce back. But they gave me a goose egg. And, um, Lamar Jackson still balling. And Tyreek Hill still balling. Lamar Jackson had about 40 points. Tyreek Hill, 27. Uh, Marlon Mack is still boring. <laughs> but um, one of his backup running backs is hurt. I can't remember if if it's Naeem Hines or Jordan Wickens. One of them guys are hurt. So Marlon Mack should get a lot more carries and just a lot more time on the field. I started Jalen Samuel last week. And <clears throat> this guy, he didn't have a good game, man. But James Conner got hurt again during a Thursday night game. So James Conner should be... A useful person to keep, but I don't know. Um, also started Damian Williams. He gained by 11. I left Ronald Jones on the bench with 18 points. Um, but, you know, it was a good week. Travis Kelsey scored. I'm happy about that. Um, so this week, week 11 in my lineup, I have the usual suspect, subsets, <laughs> the usual people in my lineup, Lamar Jackson, Tariq Hill, Cooper Cup, Martin Mack, no Jalen Samuel this time, instead of Jalen Samuel, I'm rolling with, um, I'm rolling with Miles Sanders, because Jordan Howard is hurt, so Miles Sanders should get a lot of volume, catches out of the uh, backfield is really what I'm looking for. They're playing the New England Patriots, so that's going to be a tough, tough defense. It's going to be a tough game for them because the Patriots' defense is so great. <clears throat> but, you know, I'm rolling with them. Uh, Travis Kelsey, Damian Williams. Got Damian Williams in the flex because, and they're playing Monday because uh, it was some reports that Throughout the week, it was reports that he might not play because he got family issues. But then I read a message where he's he's made the trip. I think they're playing in Mexico. And he got a real easy matchup against the Chargers. So, throw him in the lineup. Uh, it's real close to starting Ronald Jones. But I'm even on the bench. I got Court Sutton on the bench. Kenya Drake on the bench. Cream Hunt. And I picked up... Uh, Jeff Hollister. No, his name is Jacob Hollister. Tight end from the Seattle Seahawks. I got him because Travis Kelsey is on a bye next week. And Hollister might be good. You know, um, I don't want anybody else in my league to pick him up. So, I might just stash him. But, got Jay Ajayi on the waiver liar. Jay Ajayi is a good running back. And he's on the waiver wire right now. And it's, I don't know what to do because he, he hasn't played in since week five of last year. And, you know, when he did play, he was, he was, pro, he was, he was all right. He was, he's getting a lot of touchdowns. But the last year, Philadelphia Eagles offense was kind of like a committee run offense, backfield. <laughs> That's what they like to do. This year's kind of changed. It's been like Miles Sanders and Jordan Howard primarily getting the ball. So I don't know. I don't know if Jay Ajayi would be a good pickup. When you hear that name Jay Ajayi, you think, man, this dude is good. He's a baller. You know, in the past, he's played good. Coming off that ACL injury, you know, it's been players that came back and did pretty good. Like, Adrian Peterson is one name that comes to mind. I'm sure there's been more. But, um, I don't know, man. With this short bench I have, it's hard to pick up 
just players just because, you know, you can't really just stash. But I'm thinking about dropping Jacob Hollister for JGIE, but I might need Hollister next week. It's crazy. I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. I got to wait and see. But, you know, this is his first game back. He might not play much. And then next week, Howard might come back, and then you got three, three-headed monster in the backfield. So I might just not pick up Jed but I don't know how hurt Howard is. It's crazy, crazy situation. Don't know how hurt Howard is. He had a shoulder injury like two years ago. I think, but he came right back. So I don't know if it's a recurring thing. It's crazy. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> for right now, it's twelve thirty. Game's about to start. I think I'm just gonna leave my roster high it, like it is. Leave Ajayi on the bench. I mean, leave Ajayi on the waiver wire. I think the game starts at four o'clock. So something could happen. One of my players I got on the bench could get hurt, and then I can pick up Ajayi. But as for now, I'm leaving him on the waiver wire. Um, I am four and. No, I'm seven and three. I'm seven and three in second place. Week eleven. I'm ready for these playoffs to come. I'ma dominate. This is my fantasy football journal. Um, good luck out there.